Hello, 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 my dear student. This week we will be covering wave optics. We have many objectives to cover this week. We will be discussing light diffraction, reflection, and refraction using multiple format. We will develop models, use data to show that wave speed changes when the medium changes. We will use math to predict the relative change in the wave speed. And uh, we will use math to predict the relative size and location of an image formed when light passes through converging and diverging lenses. So, which photo is a ray model of longitudinal wave? Yes, the photo on the left with the parallel waves. Now, another question. What is a possible source of the longitudinal wave in the ray model on the left? I need you to answer that. What direction are rays drawn relative to the wave in front? It is perpendicular, always perpendicular. Then we will discuss uh, the diffraction principle. What is diffraction? Is the bending of light wave around the edges of an opening. This is Huygens wave model. And these waves spread out in the forward direction at the speed of the wave, creating a new wave front tangent to all of the wavelets. Now, my question for you. The model shows water waves bending around an opening. I need you to predict if sound waves would bend around a, corners, a, a, a corner. Now, you know by now that sound waves bend, diffract around corners because their wavelengths are similar enough in size to the obstacle and to the opening. Then we will be talking about reflection. What does it mean? Reflection is a phenomena that occurs when a wave bounces off an interface or another object. It will be bouncing of it. Now, this is a very important concept, the angle of reflection and the angle of incidence. We will be discussing it in details. Then we will talk about refraction. When a wave encounters a different medium, its speed, wavelength, and direction change. This is called what? A refraction. Slow down here in both cases. Look at different cases, slowing down and speeding up. Now, this is a very important concept in physics. Lenses. Lenses bend light by refraction. The point at which the rays uh, converge or appear to diverge is called the focal point. We all have been using lenses in a, a particular uh, period of our time. Here we will study it from a physics point of view. Convergent lens, also known as a convex lens, and a diverging lens is also known as a concave lens. Which type of lens is shaped so that all parallel lines appear to diverge away from a single point on the same side of the lens as the entering rays. Uh, yeah, this is a diverging lens. Now, we will be discussing the optical axis, which is an imaginary line that goes through the center of the lens and perpendicular to the lens plane. Then we will study the formation of uh, the image by different types of uh, lenses and uh, the places placing the object in a different uh, distances from at the focal, before the focal, and after the focal. What is the meaning of magnification and the lens equation, which is very important.